Access Language Arts is an iPad app and software. Eight middle school books have been adapted for students with intellectual disabilities. Access Language Arts complements the curriculum teaching to standards English language arts. First, select a book. The Outsiders by S. E. Hinton. Then select the chapter, chapters 1 and 2. To hear the title, tap the play icon next to the title. Three activities are provided at the start of a book or at the start of a set of chapters. Vocabulary, prediction, and read. Test questions are also provided after the passage is read. Tap the vocabulary icon to begin vocabulary instruction, which includes identification and meaning. Vocabulary. Each nonfiction book or fiction chapter set has four vocabulary words. This is brothers. Touch brothers. Two rounds of zero second time delay instruction are given, followed by a third round with a timed delay. During both exercises, users may skip the zero second time delay round by tapping the right directional arrow at the bottom of the screen. Tap the prediction icon to preview the text in order to make a prediction about the story. Tap to make a prediction. The first test question will revisit the answer chosen here. Read. Chapter 1. Ponyboy the Greaser. Ponyboy was the youngest of three boys. To pause the narration, tap the screen. To read the page again, tap the play icon at the beginning of the line. Chapter 1. Ponyboy the Greaser or double tap any word to resume reading at that location. Derry was responsible for the care of his two younger brothers. Single tap a word to hear it spoken. Oldest. Target vocabulary words are underlined in the story. Tap the underlined word to see and hear its definition. Responsible. Able to make the right decision. Turn the pages forward or back by tapping the left or right directional arrows at the bottom of the screen. To jump ahead or back multiple pages, touch, pause slightly, then release on a page dot. The last page of the read activity has a test button. Tap to begin the questions. Tap the hint button to hear a hint. The hint button takes the student back to the page containing the answer. Selecting an incorrect answer takes the student back to the same page and highlights the appropriate sentence. Testing vocabulary identification and vocabulary meaning is next. All four words are quizzed for both identification and meaning. Touch group. This is followed by sequencing questions. The sequencing questions are followed by nine multiple choice comprehension questions, including main character, setting, problem, and solution. Results are shown after completing the questions. To add a student account, adjust user settings, or view results, tap the gear icon. To add a student account, tap the add button. Type the student's name and tap Next. The teacher password allows you to create an optional password that needs to be typed to open options. To adjust a user's settings, select the student's name from the drop-down menu and tap Settings. The app has two tabs in Settings, Program Settings and System. Email Results. Details of the student's test results are shown at the end of each test. When an email address is entered in this field, an email will be generated at the end of each test with the detailed results. Vocabulary time delay. Set the amount of time to transpire before the verbal prompt is repeated. Omit picture cues. The default is off, which means words are presented with picture cues. Turn it on to remove picture cues. Allow skip. The default is on, 
This allows students to advance past zero time delay or vocabulary ID by tapping the forward arrow. Under test, the default for must answer correctly is on. This requires the student to select the correct answer before moving on to the next test question. Auto read choices. The default is on. This reads the answer choices right after reading the question. Auto read. Default is on. Narration will begin automatically upon starting a new page. Omit picture cues. The default is off. If turned on, symbols are removed from the preview and read activities. Delay before next is active. The default is off. If turned on, there will be a slight delay before the student can manually advance the page by tapping the forward arrow. Built-in scanning provides program access with switches. To use scanning, select one or two switches. By default, scanning is disabled. Selecting one or two switches enables multiple scan settings. Choose which sound components are heard by toggling these items on or off. Tap Set to create a photo the student will see by their name on the login window. Choose to use either the front or back camera of the iPad and tap Snapshot to take the photo. Details of student responses are saved when the student is logged into his or her account. To view a summary of a student's time using the program, tap the Usage button. The logged in user is displayed in the upper left hand corner. And now the next student has access to all of the adapted books. Access Language Arts by Attainment Company. Developed in collaboration with university partners, including Dr. Pamela Mims and her team at ETSU.